his son Jimmy's getting married. Robert told me that his son Jimmy was, as a child, obsessed with Knight Rider. What else would he possibly need for a groom's cake but a replica of Kit, the car from Knight Rider? I don't think we're going to make this jump, Michael. Hold on, Kit. <laughs> Our little Tommy's all grown up as a cake decorator, and he's going to be doing this cake pretty much on his own. Carving's not always my forte with cars, because I always carve it and it looks sort of how it looks. The two things that make Kit Kit are the lights on the front of his bumper and also the fact that he's a talking car. The light right now is in the mail somewhere. I have no idea whether the lights are going to work or not. He's got a light on the front that goes like this, and I want that. You need to call for some backup, Tommy? I'm just, uh, I'm just, I'm just trying to, uh... The thing that makes Kit Kit was this little panel on the front bumper that has these lights that go back and forth. I was a little disoriented and wanted to put it upside down, and Jeff said, like, just flip it. Bam! <laughs> Congratulations, James. For a kid, it's a car who talks. It's kind of a no-brainer to put a speaker in there. Congratulations, James. Done and done. I'm really psyched about how this kicks turned out. I would definitely have one of the kit replicas sitting right next to my DeLorean from Back to the Future. And my AT van. <laughs> Thank you, Michael, but how did I look?